Hello. He gets really sad when I leave really early in the morning. <laughs> it's gonna be okay, bud. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna go take Allie's 8 a.m. strength class at the studio. I know I'm gonna feel better after, but right now, I'm tired and scared. <laughs> Don't make me think. I just wanna be entertained. Is class gonna be easy? Sure. Are you lying? Maybe. Don't kill us, okay? No promises. Don't kill us. No promises. This, this better be a safe place. Why'd you do that? Wanna go for round two? No, why'd you do that? <laughs> Alright, took a shower. Going to film hot sauce videos for number six of cheese. Look at this thing. This is 30 international hot sauces I got from my friend Colleen. We're gonna start reviewing those on Monday videos. I'm somehow already, already so sore. We'll see how much damage I did from that dry chili chicken yesterday. From Lao Se Sean, <laughs> from Steven. <laughs> you know, I didn't have like a wake up at three in the morning just with heartburn and just palpitations out of my colon, so that's good. Oddly, I think a lot of people always think, dude, this guy's butt must just hurt. And some, I don't know how God or whatever power made me to just not be affected that badly by that stuff, but we're doing all right. It is supposed to thunderstorm today, so I'm not psyched about that, so we're driving. Sunshine and rainbows. I've been feeling good, yeah, you know that it's true. You say that you love me, baby, what you trying to do? We can see the world every day, me and you. Sunshine and rainbows. I've been feeling good, yeah, you know that it's true. You say that you love me, baby, what you trying to do? Come here, little lady. Every day is sunshine and rainbows. I've been looking good. Wait, ready? Get it. Oh, good catch. <laughs> Every day is sunshine and rainbows. I've been looking good, trying to hit this light. He's talking on fire. Take a trip out to the beef to see where the day goes. D -D -D DJ sauce. British face. red. Cheers. Yeah, I feel Cheers. It. Cheers. Lost in a sauce. Side like of these small patches. Cheers. Cheers. With an attitude, girl, you Cheers. Not all. Basic. If I told you that I love you. All right, let me know if I give you all the footage and everything, and then we'll chat on Slack. All right, sounds good. All right, see you, dude. We did five hot sauce videos in one day. Five. Content overload today. <laughs> so excited for fresh air. Just getting into this car with a backpack like an idiot. All right, we basically tried 15 different hot sauces today, so add it to the list. I've had every single one on the market by this point, so. It's a weird thing about me. Choo choo and lie. Okay, ready? Crap these windows. I'm not one to ever run away from both windows open and max AC. Am I gonna rear on the car behind me? They parked very close. You know, you might need a little tappy tap. They call it the Chicago tap. Just kind of. <laughs> I didn't actually do. I don't do that, but. Some people do. Okay, now I'm headed to the grocery store. I'm gonna pick up some stuff for the vlog for some different episodes I'm gonna shoot this week. A little grocery run for Hey Sean Ely, and then, let's go left here. That person probably hates me. Um, and then I'm gonna also snag a bottle of Jepson's Malort, the finest of liqueurs, for a friend, fan of the show, Quentin Nelson. Gonna send him some in Iowa to try because he's a sucker for punishment just like I am. And you know, he wants bitter Malort face to happen in his life. So Quentin, I'm gonna get that for you and send that. I got a box and everything in the trunk of this car. You know, we're getting stuff done today. That's why we're vlogging today. We're just showing you guys the inner workings of a Monday. While you all were stuck in the office working hard and probably providing for your families, this is what I did today. <laughs> Goals! No, seriously, keep your normal job. Uh, wait a minute. What the fuck is going on? Alright, 
Q, the good stuff, coming to you. Iowa will never be the same, my friend. The perfect box to send this to Quentin. A lot of foam. Some real fancy wrapping, look at this. It's like a really nice bottle of wine from Napa. <laughs> but it ain't. You never be too cautious. That ain't moving. All right, I feel good about this. Let's drop this off to UPS. Hi, how's it going? Have a great rest of the day. Bye. There were two girls in there that were about to ship two like gigantic frames. I thought they were paintings. They were gonna cost a thousand dollars each because they had to custom build a crate at UPS to put them in to ship them to California. So, what? She's like, Dad built me two frames again. What is life? All right, back home. I've got a voiceover commercial audition for Cheese It, <laughs> which is just every kid's dream. So I'm gonna go upstairs and knock that out. I'm going where Cheese It dreams come true. I'm going to Cheese It World, baby. <laughs> I'm going where Cheese It dreams come true. I'm going to Cheese It World, baby. Okay, the world craves cheese, and I'm gonna bring it. That's why I'm gonna be the coat, cheesiest of all time. Get it? <laughs> they're redoing these cheese it ads, so they're kind of an open call. I'm gonna be the coat, cheesiest of all time. Get it? Audition's done. Back in the car. I walked the dog. Did some editing. Now we're headed back outside Here's and we're. What? I found. what? <laughs> and now at 5 12 p.m. on Monday, we're going to the south side. We're going to Bridgeport. We're going to Phil's Pizza, which is a south side staple. I've never been there. So thanks to our donor here today, we finally made it to the main food portion of the vlog. You guys stuck in there. I'm proud of you, Mr. Jeffrey De La Paz. De La Paz, De La Paz, De La Paz. <laughs> you know, names are so funny, you know? It's like numbers are so crazy, am I right? Amen. Not really. Doing this at rush hour. <laughs> it didn't work out great timing wise, but we're staying Positive. Sick and tired of ya never showing the South Side love. Phil's Pizza on 35th and Aberdeen and Bridgeport. And don't forget the Valentina hot sauce, boy. -y. Go White Sox. <laughs> One of the more aggressive donation notes, but you know what? I'm here for it. Also, I said, thanks for the donation, Jeff. I go where the donations tell me to go, so Phil's I go. He goes with pepperoni. I'll get pepperoni. I like to get the orders the way you guys like the orders. That's what the that's what this whole shebang is about. She bangs, she bangs. Oh baby. Also yesterday, some of the most super thanks. I think the most super thanks I've ever gotten on a video. You can click the thanks button, donate directly to the vlog. I try to do this every single day when I, you know, don't go absolutely insane and pull my hair out with the things I have to do. Like, did you see today? I have to go home and edit this after. <laughs> we had super thanks from Maurice Haney, Quentin Nelson, Darcy Deming, Quentin Nelson again, Quentin Nelson a third time, Knockout King, and the legend Colleen Maxwell. You guys. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Also, Quentin, you were the MVP of the Super Thanks. Let's be honest with all those, so MVP status. Hi, can I do a takeout order? Sean? Sean, what do you do? Can I do a uh, medium pepperoni? And then one small with black olive. Black olive? Yeah. Okay, Okay, see you soon. Bye. Bye. Old school is f calling on the phone. <laughs> to my knowledge, they don't have online ordering or any sort of delivery whatsoever. Like, you, if you want it, you come get it. South side. Strong side? There it is. Phil's Pizza, the best in Chicago since 1960. This is going to be one hell of a first time eating. Also, it got really sunny. It was like pouring rain earlier. What a day.
Jeff, I'm very excited for this. I just want you to know how excited I am. It's very windy. Hi, right, there's a pickup for Sean. Yeah, thank you so much. Okay, I have never in my life seen this before. They just give them to you not in a box? <laughs> Is that a Southside Chicago thing and I have no culture and don't know that that's a thing they do down here? Let's install this dining room table and get into this. I got Allie a small black olive for her dinner. Her favorite pizza topping, some of you think it's weird, some of you realize she's a genius. Is this gonna be uncut and I'm not gonna be able to eat this? Oh, it's cut. This smells and looks so good. The pepperoni under the cheese. All right, for those of you new to the channel, I live in Chicago, Illinois. I live downtown, and I'm kind of in this crux of like a lot of touristy deep dish spots, Chicago deep dish pizza, big old thick boy, and then the much more wildly, widely respected, kind of more for locals in Chicago, tavern style pizza, thin crust, crunchy, cheesy, toppings underneath, cracker thin almost, and cut into squares, kind of. Then some of them are kind of rectangles, and some are, then you got the triangle spots over here. But this smells and looks so good. Supposed to be one of Chicago's, Chicago's iconic spots. I butchered that accent. How we looking? All right, Jeffrey, thanks for donating to the vlog. I got the Valentino, we'll get into that soon. It's amazing how you can take two bites of a piece of pizza and instantly know whether or not it's in like the top tier. That's all it took for me to know this. The quality instantly. It's like crunchy on the crust, soft and flaky and kind of doughy on the bites on this side. The sauce is incredible. It's like a refreshing pizza. Like you just splash water in your face. The equivalent of how that feels on a hot day and then eating this pizza are the same. <laughs> that didn't make sense. That doesn't make sense. They got some herbs on here, a little bit of like oregano, whatever it is, Italian seasonings. Now I did notice one of my pet peeves with tavern style is when you go to take a bite, a lot of times the entire cheese comes with it. And you gotta be careful, you gotta like, your teeth, you need teeth like Baraka for Mortal Kombat. You know, like, pinch through it, <laughs> rather than like, rectangle teeth, <laughs> just slide in it like this. You really gotta chomp. Okay, see, is that it? If I would've pulled, it would've all come off. You almost had to put your finger and like, push the cheese down. That I kinda don't get. Everything else is perfect. Hey guys. Don't forget to bring a towel. What? <laughs> Jeffrey knows, he noted it in his donation. Valentina hot sauce might be the best mass produced hot sauce, if you will, in the game. Oh my God. I think it moved. There's so much more garlic in it. It's insane. I've never seen the no pizza box thing before. Are they onto something here? Jeff, my dude, do you live down here in Bridgeport? What are some other spots I need to go to? You steered me in the right direction, my friend. I sent my agent that Cheese it audition. Like I only showed you guys a couple of the takes, like I did a bunch of stuff. And she <laughs> she right away said like she instantly thought of me for that. I'm going where cheese dreams come true. I'm going to Cheese World, baby. Audition because it's such a character. Like, how could I not play a wheel of cheese? Like that is my that is my career. Wow. With the Valentina, it made it from great to greatest. So Vito and Nick's to me, still better. I also really liked Nancy's Pizza. I got that tavern style, that was fantastic. This is up there, like this is so good. I just ate an entire third of it. You just run the row, just run the row. We've had a hell of a day, you guys. I hope you enjoyed me taking around, you guys around for part of my day, a lot of my day. Look, I all slid off, I need Baraka teeth. This is great. Jeffrey De La Paz sauce. Look at that coverage. I'm like Verizon, bro. Can you hear me now? No, because you unsubscribed. Cause you're corny as f
What a Monday night dinner. Can't believe this is the sixth YouTube video I've made today. If you stayed all the way to the end, you're a closer. Coffee's for you, my friend. I want to get this other one home to Allie. They got about a 15, 20 minute drive back home. I don't want it to get too cold. They do seal them really well. Look at this, I mean, you don't even need a box. Like, you went right back in here so well. That's really cool. Banging on a trash can. Brent, did you ever find a lead on that power washer? See you later. All right, teaching every one of you that make this vlog possible. This is such a fun, filled day. That yoga class feels like it was days ago at this point. Yoga class, it's, Ellie basically took a two by four and beat the living crap out of me for 60 minutes. <laughs> Ellie just texted me, how is it? Which means she's wondering where I am because she's so excited for her pizza. You guys be good to each other. I love each and every one of you. Thank you for being here. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. If you want new videos like this basically every single day, like the video. Huge numbers on yesterday's Chinese food video out of nowhere, which was so, so nice. So if you're new to the channel, hi, I'm Sean. I'm so, so glad you're here. And uh, back to the north side we go. Hit me with more south side spots. I want to get to know this spot, this neighborhood, this place, especially Bridgeport because it's one of my favorite places, even more than I already do. Phil's pizza up. Phil's pizza down. I think I just literally cracked something in my neck. Hold me close. Let your spirit catch a young and like the Holy Ghost. I got so much on my plate and I just doubled up. That's what it takes if you're going to really do the most. Be a star, now you shining on your ex. Running numbers. Yeah, I'm stunting. Watch me flex. That's just the way it goes. They don't want to see you broken in the trenches out here working on your image, sharing love with all your peeps. Well, I ain't really with it. Everyone's invited to my cookout. You and you and yours and even Uncle Greg that got a hit in bottle. Okay, go for the littlest piece first. Ooh, look at that cheese pole. I go crazy cause she looks like it fly, but she stings like it feet.